Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share with you my flight essentials for glowing skin. So it really took me some time to figure out which products would be the best and what to use. So um, I'm so excited to share with you my kind of tricks and tips and products that I use. So let me start by showing you the first thing that I do. So once I get to the plane, I make sure that I don't have any makeup on. Now I know it sounds a little scary, especially if you like traveling with a boyfriend or you know someone that you still need to like impress in a way. Um, but honestly, your skin will thank you. So you can wear makeup up until you sit on that plane, but if you have six hour flight, trust me, your skin needs to breathe. So what I like to do is I always have this with me. If you are not familiar with this little magic thing, you need to. It's called a makeup eraser and this is the most brilliant invention ever known to any woman's face. It's a microfiber kind of clot and you literally don't need anything to put on it to actually take your makeup off. What I do is that I like to wet it with warm water and then you just like take your face off. It's literally what it is. So if you have mascara, eyeshadow, red lipstick, literally everything and anything, this little thing will take it off and leave no trace behind. Next thing that I do is I always carry this little bottle with me. So this is good for flight. It's a travel size and I buy them like at a Dollarama store. And what I put in is rose water. And this is where I'm taking it from. This is uh, from a company called The Heritage Store and it's just rose water and it's from European roses. Sounds good to me. Just put it in my little travel bottle and I take it everywhere. I'll spritz it on my face. Spritz, spray, but I spritz. I spritz it on my face and I'll just like to tap to kind of wake my face up a little and let it soak in. It helps to tone the skin and kind of prepare it for the next stages of my skincare routine. I'll use it also during the flight in general. I'll have it beside me and when I feel like my skin needs a little pick me up, I'll spritz it on my face and kind of move on with my life. Benny left me a little present. Once I'm done with toning my skin, it's time to put moisturizer and this is one of my favorite moisturizers ever. This is by a company called Emberlease and this is a French company. I had one subscriber that warned me that there's parabens in here. Um, I did my research, there are no parabens. It's paraben free and preservative free, so that's nice. Because it's so lightweight, it's really nice on the skin and it doesn't feel heavy, especially in an environment when there's no like air circulation. Sometimes when you put a lot of things on your skin, um, it just feels like your skin gets clogged in a way. So what I like about this uh, moisturizer is that when you put it, it feels like it soaks right in. So because we are in the airplane and your skin gets so dehydrated, I feel like I've been using this word gazillion times already during this video, I'm sorry. Um, I like to mix my moisturizer with this Phyto Replenish Oil from Dermalogica. This is such a great product. Um, I've been using it quite a bit and it kind of goes so well together because this one soaks right in. I'm a big oil lover, but I do find that sometimes it's just, it feels too like, ah, like I want to wash it off, you know? So what I do is I'll use the Emberly's moisturizer like this and then I'll just mix it with like two, three drops of this replenish oil and um, then it just creates the most amazing flight moisturizer and this I recommend for you guys even to use if you do feel like your skin needs hydration this is a really important part of my routine I beg you to use sunscreen when you fly because you are up in the sky the UV rays are so much stronger this is the sunscreen that I use so once I have my moisturizer with my oil on my skin I'll just use my La Roche Posay lotion and this has 60 SPF um, you can use honestly I've been reading quite a bit about SPFs and I've noticed that a lot of articles say that SPF 
30 is the ultimate SPF. Anything above 30 is not very substantial protection wise. And you always want to make sure this is it's UVB plus UVA. Uh, you want to be protected from both of them. I'll just have my EOS to constantly moisturize my lips. And to hydrate from the inside out, um, you obviously know that you need to drink a lot of water during the flight and stay away from too like salty stuff because it just retains water. Another product that I actually discovered recently, these little tablets um, that's from a company called Noon Active and these are so cool. These are like electrolyte supplement. Um, they have different flavors and these are so great because it's very subtle. It's not very sweet It puts flavor in your water, but it also gives you electrolytes that actually hydrate you much more efficiently I also like to use them when I sweat a lot like when I work out This is a great way to hydrate and if you want something sweet in general like something poppy to drink stay away from it This thing just like fizzes in your water and then you have a great kind of a little bubbly water so I love you using it during the flight, love. And I actually give it to my kids and to my husband. The last thing that I like to do right before we land, I like to use eye patches. It really helps with kind of calming my eyes and depuffing them. I got to try this new company recently. It's called Masquerade and I love their hydrating eye gel mask. You just apply it, it's really easy, you know the trick. Um, and you just leave, I leave it on for like 20 to 30 minutes. Why I like this company is because it's much cleaner than a lot of the other companies that I've seen. So this one's mineral oil free, there's no parabens, uh, there's no artificial fragrance, which I hate that they use in eye patches. It's driving me crazy. So um, this one is um, a great option for you. Obviously, obviously sanitizer. This is my favorite one. It's lavender organic hand sanitizers from Dr. Bruner's. I always find them at Whole Foods and I buy them all the time. So I always use it like a lot. I'll just walk around and like, ta-da! This is my kit on the go when I'm flying. I hope you guys learn a little bit of something, something, something. That's honestly one of the most important things for me, that every video you learn a little trick or a little something that will benefit your life. I hope you did in this one. Let me know what you think about this video and if you have any other requests or suggestions, I am here to listen to everything your heart desires to tell me. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys on the next video.